What is up everyone, Dimitri V2 here, and welcome back to the Iron Man Challenge. Now before we start off with the video, I would like to mention a few things. All of this footage you're gonna be watching in the video is going to be old footage. I recorded about 30 to 40 hours of Iron Man content before Fortuna's launch, and things have kind of changed in the meantime. And the main thing that has changed for this account are the vault runs. Beforehand, you could run only one key at a time, and you only had a 25% chance to open the vault that you got. The footage you'll see during this video is made with that old method. However, with a recent patch, they introduced the, a new method where you can now basically run all four keys at the same time, giving you a 100% chance to open the vaults and speeding things up by quite a bit, as you can imagine. Now, here's the thing. I haven't decided yet how I'll be doing the vault runs in the future. I kind of liked keeping track of which keys I got at which times, and with the new method, this aspect would basically completely disappear. Now, by the time I get around to uploading more recent Iron Man footage, I'll let you guys know what a decision I've come to. Um, but in the meantime, let me know in the comments section as well what you guys think I should do. Continue the old method of one key at a time and keep track of what I get. Or do I just say, screw it and run multiple keys at once, speeding up the process by quite a bit, but also stopping to keep track of everything that I get. Let me know what you guys think and uh, enjoy the video, fellas. Until next time, peace. All right, some late vault runs after the second dream. Let's see if we can get anything. Let's see if our new operator can bless us with narrow-minded. Nope. Nope. That, that's like the opposite of what you want. Unfortunate. Oh, well, at least it's a new one, I guess. It's going to be trenched for the... I wouldn't even mind trenching any of the warfare mods I would like because I can sell it for plat, but narrow-minded is the one that I really want to get, and that's why we're going to get enemic agility. Well, at least it's a new one, I guess, but fucking hell, man. You have blessed us with a narrow-minded ribbon right over here. This won't be easy. Kill myself without the this challenge. I find it a lot of fun, actually. The, the thing about it, right, you could see it as a chore, like, oh god, then I'm gonna have to spend, like, anywhere between, like, 10 to 20, 30 hours of farming vault runs, right? The way I see it is, oh, nice, I get to do 30 hours of grinding where, like, it actually is kind of fun trying to figure out what I'm gonna get every time, right? Every single attempt that I do, every single attempt that I start could be, like, the one thing that I want to get, right? This could be the run, I don't know. I could explore, I could find a vault at the very end of this hallway, or not. And it could be a decaying key, and if it is a decaying key, which is a 1 in 4 chance, then, you know, maybe that's the one. Maybe it's a warfare mold that I still need, maybe it's even narrow-minded. I mean, if I get a warfare mold right now, that's extra platinum for me. If I get narrow-minded, I'm done. My grind is over. I have everything that I need at that point, making my arsenal of mods a lot stronger. That's kind of the stuff that keeps me going, right? It's why this grind is actually fun for me. Because this is one of the few R like true RNG grinds, I feel. Like this. Like, what is it gonna be? It's gonna be a hobble key. It's a decaying key, even. Even better. So we actually get something. So now I can pick it up. And now the hype is even more. What's it gonna be, Trot? Curious. It could be the, the run You've got it. where we get narrow-minded. Instead, we get the plate of reload, security. and then you feel kind of bad inside, but that's okay. Because that also happens. But we are getting a new mod again, so it's another one off the list. I'm gonna call Nemic Agility. Something is different about this this is the one. This is the anemic agility run we have all been waiting for all this time. <sighs> I already had this one. Whatever, it's fine. Get your calls out in chat. I'm gonna call narrow minded to finish off the day. 113 attempts. It's going to be overextended again. Hey, thank you very much for another 30 platinum. I'll take that. And there we go. Alright, more forma. Working catalysts, keep them coming. Bunch of uh, happy with a bunch of that stuff. But this is the main thing that I wanted to get. We have a dread, an automos, and a shade. I'm gonna have to make spots for that. I think I have some MK1 weapons to sell though. So let me check real quick. Uh, weapons. 
We got that one, the Broken War. I'm happy with that. Uh, Karak. I might just get rid of the Karak because later today I'm going to be building the Soma. Uh, Lex, I do need to keep for because it's a component. Uh, MK1 Furious, I can sell as well. And the MK1 Paris, I can sell because we now have a Dread, so we don't need the MK1 Paris anymore. So I'm going to sell all three of these. Make up some uh, spots again. Now we have some slots. And there we go. Now we claim the Atomos as well. So we have a bunch of good stuff. Happy about that. Let's uh, let's go level this stuff up. I still have a day left on my Affinity Booster from Barrel Kateer that I bought. It cost me all of my credits and my Ducats, but it's worth it. So uh, let's go level all of this stuff up and get to MR6 so we can build ourselves a Soma. And there we go. Round 3 complete. And I'm pretty sure that that's it. Easy. There we go, boys. MR6 acquired. The best thing about this is we finally, finally get to build the Soma and actually get a good automatic primary. Oh, that's going to be so good. Let's go straight to the marketplace and buy that thing. Easy master rank test. The first, like, 10 MR test, I don't think I even need to practice. I probably should, though, just in case I ever mess one up. But there we go. It's been a while. It's... It's been a long time, actually, since I've used the normal Soma, but there we go. Perch the blueprint. We already have most of the stuff. I'm going to quickly farm up about 6,000 salvage, and then we're going to come back and build that bad boy. See you in a bit. So since I've now built the trading post in my dojo, I am allowed to start trading now. I didn't want to start trading before I had my trading post. Um, I acquired some extra overextended uh, from the vault runs that I've done so far. So I'll be selling those for about market price average. I'll be using War from the Market for that as well. Uh, currently, overextended seem to be going about 30 platinum each. So I'll be selling an overextended to this guy over here for 30 platinum. I will be recording and showing every single trade that I do. So there we go. That's the first trade of the account, overextended at 30 platinum, which is market price appropriate for the time of the trade. Everyone on my stream can confirm that as well. And there we go. That is 30 platinum for overextended. That's the first trade. Thank you very much, sir. Appreciate that. And there we go. It is done. Feels good, man. Now we need to sell the other overextended and then we're good to go. That actually looks really sick. Holy crap. But I'm going to be trading my second overextended for that one. We only need one overextended total. I don't need any more than that. Overextended. There we go. That's another 30 platinum. There goes all of my credits, though, but it's so worth it. We've got that one sold as well. Thank you very much, sir. I appreciate that. Trade was successful. I will be leaving now. Because that means interacting with other people, and that's scary. And now we should have 80 platinum. So it's about time to make the most important purchase of the entire series. And that is the classic saturated color scheme. It is done. We can finally use proper colors as I go down to 5 platinum. If I ever need slots in the near future, I'm going to be screwed, but... It, it's so worth it. It's so, so worth it. Alright, I should have done this a long time ago. It's thanks to the help of chat that I actually they reminded me. But I'm going to be slapping my generic lens that I got from the Second Dream on my Frost. The reason for that is that currently, and for the foreseeable future, I will be using nothing but Frost anyway. But well, Frost. <clears throat> so it helps having a focus lens on there. So at the very least, I can be, start building up a bit here and there. I don't have the required stuff anyway to go focus farming yet. So I might as well just slap it on there. It's a normal generic lens. It's pretty easy to acquire. But just get some extra focus here and there. And would you look at that? That That's pretty beautiful. But I first want to finish this thing off though. I want to get the uh, Snipetron Vandal blueprint. And then we'll go farm EO for salvage. And there we go, enough salvage farmed for the Soma. 12 hour build time, I'll be using this next time I play on the account. But I cannot wait for this gun. This is this feels really nice to have that done. For now though, in the meantime, while we wait for this thing to complete, we have more vault runs to do, so that's exactly what I'm going to be doing. I only have, no, I have 14 circuits. My god. Alright, well, I guess I gotta do this one mission and then four more circuits of all things. Holy shit. All right. Please be a narrow minded so I'm done with this grind. 118 volts in, and it's going to be. <laughs> Another 30 platinum! Thank you very much, game. I appreciate that. I don't mind that at all. I actually like that. That's another 30 plat. That's really good. Thank you very much. All right. Next up is going to be Animic Agility. Tainted Magazine, even worse. Oh, well. Is that new? I don't think so. I do need a bit more nanospores, though, I prefer, but oh well. 
I saw that coming. I'm like, those two barrels are way too close, but I shot anyway. Fucking. <laughs> uh, Alright, well. I'm gonna quickly forget about that, and we're gonna wash away the memory with something even more painful. Corrupt charge! Yes, thank you, game. Appreciate that a lot. I am gonna call anemic agility again. I don't know, that one haunts me always. Instead, it's critical deceleration. Fuck. Well, whatever. At least we get another one out of the way, I guess. And I got two mutants and samples. That's... Well, you gotta think positive with this kind of stuff. You gotta, you gotta remain positive. All right, here we go. Frail momentum, son of a shit. Oh well, whatever. At least it's another one to the list. Frail momentum. All right, here we go, fellas. I got another overextended. I'm gonna sell that to someone in my chat as well. Thank you very much for that. That's gonna be another 30 platin platinum added to the account with the V2 badge as well. There we go. Uh, one overextended. Uh, where is it? Overextended. There we go. I I'm liking this one a lot. I've already gotten it four times. I still haven't gotten there reminded yet, but <laughs> I have made it already 90 platinum off of Vault Runs alone, so that's pretty good. Another 30 platinum. Feels good, man. Thank you very much for that. And we're off farming some more platinum. I mean, never mind. Alright, there we go. Uh, anemic Agility. Spoil Strike. Okay, that one took a bit to load in, but that's fine, spoiled strike. I'm not too worried about that. I don't know what it's gonna be, but I hope it's gonna be a good one. I do know that I have five mutant examples though, so I'm pretty happy with that already. I still wanna call anemic agility, just because last time around it, I got so many, and I'm actually kinda surprised I've only got like two, I think, so far this um, this time around, so. Anemic agility, here we go. Nope, hollow point. Oh well, at least I got five mutant examples, two Oricon cells, and 4k nanospore, so I'm more happy with that than that, but hey, we got something. Yes! Alright, boys. Final key for now. Of the day, at the very least. What is it gonna be, brothers? What are we calling? Until we get you to extraction, that I am... For the final one, I am gonna call Narrow Minded. Just finish it off with the one that we need, and then we're done. Narrow Minded incoming, fellas. That's... Oh. It's something. It's something. Alright, so the next thing that I want to unlock on this account is going to be the Index. Now, it's going to be pretty painful farming in the Index solo with the weapons and everything that I have. But to help with that, I'm going to be building a Rhino. Because Rhino's Iron Skin works really, really well for doing solo. Or just Index runs in general, I should say. So I'm going to be building this right now. We already farmed him up in a previous episode, of course. So we're going to be building him. And then once these parts are done, we're going to be uh, finishing off the actual Rhino. And then I'm going to get my weapons ready for some Index runs here and there as well. We got ourselves a Vital Sense mod. This is actually new, it doesn't show it, but this is new, we didn't have that yet. Which is gonna buff up the Dread and also the Soma that's currently building by quite a bit. So we're gonna level that up, slot that in, and we're just gonna enjoy like the triple damage that comes with it. It's gonna be a good time. 